I titled the album Legend of Black Moses uh, after one of my favorite freedom fighters or liberators, Harriet Tubman, uh, who went by the name Black Moses or Moses. And the title and theme uh, is a reimagining of freedom fighters or historical liberators as superheroes, because that's exactly what they are. They were our heroes to be learned from then and now. Um, And also the MC or writer as a potential liberator or freedom fighter. Because if you think about uh, the potentiality of words and their ability to liberate the minds of the people, um, if the artist's platform was chosen to, to be used in that way, um, it's, it's, very, it's, it's a very profound thing. Um, and I've always said in my music that um, I'm trying to leave, leave legend. You know, because it's, it's very important to think about years from now, light years from now, what people will think about you, what legacy you'll be leaving for your family, what legacy you'll be leaving for your name and for yourself when people hear what you've left in the ethers. So, um, hence the title and the theme. A lot of people see me and don't know what to expect. I get... Um, singer a lot you know but um this album i'm really really coming for all of your favorite rappers um in 19 songs or less <laughs> you know i it's it's the plight of of the mc you you are taught to be humble but you can't get anything without being hungry so you know this this album is is competition for sure um and I'm coming at they next. But this this mixtape is funny. I always thought that I would never do a mixtape. I always said, I don't want to do a mixtape. It, it seemed, uh, it's always seemed kind of false or, false or forced to me to rap over someone else's beats or rework someone else's beats. But I understand now the importance of um, expanding my audience base or fan base to those who may not be familiar with Soul Messiah's production or myself as an MC, um, to work on that familiarity of popular beats. And we trust and believe that these beats were carefully selected and curated um, to reflect my personal taste, Soul Messiah's personal taste. So we have, you know, a range of, you know, beats from some of my favorite producers from Premiere to uh, Mad Lib to Flying Lotus. So it's still me, it's still Sarak, it's still my lyrics, it's still elevating consciousness, but it's just a little taste of the familiar for those who may not know who I am. And uh, I'm going in, you know. This is, in a sense, my introduction to the world, to a broader audience, like I've said, and I'm challenging MCs, I'm challenging producers um, to step their bars up and step their production up respectively to make beats for MCs, you know, real MCs to spit over. It's it's not a game. And every word that I leave on this microphone is intended to be impactful, you know, and this album is no different. The Legend of Black Moses is created in honor, in the honor and spirit of those ancestors that, that fought and died for me to be standing here, and I don't take that lightly. I'm not doing this in vain. So this is what the world has been waiting for.